We are here with uh, Aiden Spinett on the uh, RBV Ranch in uh, beautiful Vista, California, after a very, very exciting 3-2 to two win over uh, Poway. And Aiden uh, delivered the key hit in, uh, in that 3-2 uh, to two win. So, tell me about that. What pitch was it? What did you do with that pitch? Well, the fastball outside, a little out of the zone, and I just tried taking my bat out and hopefully it work. So, I mean, that's, it's 3-2, uh, bases loaded, and I think, I mean, the real pressure, you're a sophomore. Did you feel any pressure in that yeah, thing? Yeah, definitely. Okay. I wanted to deliver. Okay, did you feel, uh, did you, are you also aware of the irony here that, of course, Poway beat us 4-3 to three yeah. and exactly the same kind of hit yeah. a couple of weeks ago? Right. Yeah, good. So, now you're on varsity, right? Sophomore. Not many sophomores play varsity. Has it been everything you thought that it would be? Yeah, the competition is pretty tough. I started out slow, and I, just, I tried working harder. It's paid off so far. So what's been the most difficult adjustment for you uh, to move? I mean, you didn't move from JVs. You moved from freshman to a varsity. What is, what's the biggest difference, the most difficult thing you had adjusting? I think the pitching is a lot better. The uh, dirtier stuff. You have to really recognize the off-speed. So, for, so for the for the non-baseball people, dirtier stuff like your your uniforms dirty. What does yeah, that mean? Dirty? Sliders, curveballs, change up, that kind of stuff. And this guy today had a really good slider, as yeah. a matter of fact. Now to make things even more difficult for you, you've been moved around a lot. So you've moved from third base to first base to now a DH. Uh, does that bother you at all? Do you think that affects your play with all these these movements? Uh, no, I like to be out in the field, but as long as I'm in the starting lineup, I'm happy. Now, your parents, uh, of course, you're the brother of Jake Stinnett, one of the uh, uh, outstanding players here uh, last year. Your parents are back in Maryland watching Jake play right at this moment. Isn't that true? Yeah. Good. Is that your goal? Do you want to do what your brother did? Do you yeah, want to go on? definitely. I want to play in college, play in college and hopefully go further. So, so do you have feel I now I have a brother and my brother and I were tremendously competitive. I mean, everything we played basketball, we play, are you and your brother competitive? Yeah, we've always been competitive um, from wiffle ball games, basketball, any of that stuff. Yes, I I know exactly what that is. And my brother, in fact, went on to beat me almost all the time. <laughs> so tell me the last thing here. What about this name and uh, name Aiden? Now I, I'm another person who has been burdened all of his life with one of these oddball names being a Norbert. So, where is Aiden from, and uh, is it a burden for you? Uh, I guess it's from Ireland or something, but I'm not even Irish. Um, but it's not a, it's a burden sometimes when they can't pronounce my name, they don't spell it right half the time. Well, that's true, but, and no teachers shout out to, hey, give me an Aiden here. They always say, give me John. So that is a kind of advantage. So let me just say for everybody that that you've had a really good start. You're hitting the ball well, and we're really pleased to have you in the ball club. You're a really fine young man, and we wish you the best of luck. Thank you. Hold it. Hold it. I don't know.